A contrived mediating stimulus. It's contrived because it's fake. No, sorry. I just see. I get go watch contrived contingency and understand why I really have a problem with that word contrived. So anyway, contrived mediating stimulus. It's any stimulus that's made functional. All right. So it, it, it's it's a stimulus that you use in the training setting that you can take with you into the natural setting. The instructional. So, sorry, you can use it in the instructional setting where you're learning to do a response or a skill set. And then you take this little thing with you, whatever it is, out into the real world, the natural setting, <laughs> roll size. Um, and then it can help prompt you engage in the behavior. It's like an additional discriminative stimulus that can help you make things nice and smooth, um, make things actually work. It, it, it helps with generalization. Um, oftentimes you could, well, I suppose in the most probably inappropriate sense that would be a wedding ring right you know it's kind of a contrived to remind you of your your significant other um in my case it's a wife um so so <laughs> i'm just being relevant in 2016 folks i'm not trying to make jokes um so in my case it, it reminds me of my wife it helps um, generalize behavior outside of her presence as you might in instructional settings in real world <laughs> sorry kim i apologize <laughs> Uh, this went live probably by the time you saw it, and I'm going to definitely be in the fucking doghouse now. <laughs>